what is up welcome back to the first official weekly vlog i'm so excited um i am just getting ready this morning i am going to costco i have a bit of a costco run this morning um and then what am I doing today? I have a Costco run. I need to shoot some content because Becca, as in Becca Cosmetics, I actually got a product sent from them. Just one product, but listen, it's a start. And so I need to shoot that for Instagram later. Hopefully I'll be able to do it today. I have a call with my therapist at 2.30 and then we're going to go out for a bit of a sundowner this evening hope well not even sundowner because we're going the evening so yeah um yeah how have you guys been how's the new year treating you guys i'm just doing my face i'm using the inky list products you guys know these have been my ride or dies since um june i want to say so and if my eyes look weird guys it's because i can't see i don't have my contacts in i don't have my glasses on so this image in front of me is very blurry and i might squint my eyes because it's just reflex i just sometimes squint to try and see better it's stupid doesn't even work i don't know why i do it but listen we move okay but anyway how have you guys been i owe you guys so many videos well not i don't owe you but you know there's so many videos i want to put out I know that every year I tend to put out my, not every year, I've done it two years now. I tend to put out my, um, what do you call it, my goals and reflections video. Um, so I'm planning on filming that, I don't know, maybe this weekend. The problem is, guys, in winter here, the sun sets at 4.30. But um, I'm going to film that hopefully this weekend. Um... Hopefully get that out this weekend or I'll film it this weekend. I'll probably not go out for a little bit because I still have to get the second Costa Rica vlog out, which will be this Sunday. I hope you guys can't hear that music in the background because if you can it means I'm gonna be copyrighted. But yeah guys, 2021 guys, can you imagine? I'm so excited in a way though, but I'm also trying not to be anxious about how the year will pan out. I don't know why I'm even anxious because technically last year, I personally, like in terms of my goals and stuff, my life wasn't too disrupted by the pandemic. Like I still managed to like pivot and readjust um, and still have somewhat of a good year. Um, so I don't know why I'm anxious. I think it's because everyone in the world around is basically saying, oh my gosh, I hope it's better, I hope it's better. Uh, uh. And that, I think, is weighing on me. And I'm trying to not let it weigh on me because I should not be taking on people's problems. Um, hope you guys are using sunscreen. Um, this is the sunscreen I use. It's the Black Girl sunscreen. And I actually saw that they're about to launch, or they launched for pre-order. Um, a matte version so I'm so excited because that will come in really handy for the summertime so. and I saw I think it's SPF 45 even the matte one so I'm pretty excited about that hello everybody so y'all you guys I forgot to vlog oh my lips I'm wearing this fancy cream lip lip cream the new ones yeah anyway um i forgot to vlog all day i don't know why but now it is evening time and we're about to go get a drink at this place near our house in a very socially distanced safe way in our little bubble so yeah if i'm getting Graces with his presence. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, people? It's good. It's good out there, my It's good out there. I got you. 
Hey guys, so we just got to dinner or a drink, whatever you want to call it. Oh, my lip gloss is gone off. Thank you. Um, and yeah, we just. I got my. Huh? Did you, did you enter your card details and everything? Enter. I just I don't know who asked for people to lower their mask. <laughs> Please press one. Well, listen, you need to know who, who, it is. Who, who it is. Yeah. So you guys, we are finally done. It is bedtime. We are here. Oh. We are here. Please, Nipa. The other participants in this. Oh. It is. Thank you. We are here. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So we are here. We're about to head back social home. Social distancing. Of course. We were socially distanced the entire time. Wore our masks when we were not eating or drinking. So yeah, we're about to go home now. Hey guys. So we just got back home and I'm about to shower. But I started taking off my makeup. And I thought, well, let me get this on camera. And today, I wanted to show you what I'm using to cleanse today. I finally got off my bum. I finally got off my bum and went to restock on my salicylic acid cleanser from the Inky List. This is actually like my favorite or my preferred at the moment um, cleanser. I've been using it since June. I ran out some maybe two three months ago and i haven't restocked since but then i what does it say on? sorry there's just writing on the box that i never noticed so i went to pick this up i went to sephora and i found it in stock and i bought it usually it's not in stock in stores sometimes it's online but also it sells out a lot quickly online and the reason being that it's really affordable and it's a very good cleanser like it's nine dollars nine ninety nine and it's a it's a quite a substantial bottle and it's a really really good cleanser like I'd compare it to any high-end cleanser it's very good but it's very affordable so anyway I'm using this to cleanse and I'm also trying out this um dermalogica daily microfoliant this is the sample not the sample size it's the mini size i don't know if you guys can see that but basically i'll show you guys um after this so it's like it's an exfoliant so i'm gonna cleanse my face and then um basically what happens is you put this on your on wet hands and it's powder and it basically transforms into a paste and you use it to exfoliate so that's what i'm using to exfoliate today i only exfoliated once this week so i think i'm still good and then i actually wanted to come on here and show you guys something this is a bargain you guys i bought these sheet masks this is like two packs of sheet masks and they're by the brand Innisfree which is actually like a Korean skincare brand and they have very good products. I remember I had a, a number of samples that I tried when I went to Gen Beauty in 2018. They had a store there and I picked up quite a few samples and I enjoyed them but again it's one of those brands is Korean so outside of the states and probably like Korea they're not that easily accessible um and granted they're not super expensive but i thought this was a deal a good deal in any case because this is a pack of i want to say it's 10 masks and it usually goes 10 sheet masks and it usually goes for 16 or 18 dollars and i got all 10 for 9.99 10 sheet masks for 9.99 to put it in context the garnier one when they're on the garnier moisture bomb ones you guys know i use those all the time when those are on sale they do i think it's maybe three if it's on sale it's three for no it's two for five 
two for five dollars when they are on sale so that gives you a bit of like context so like even when those ones are on sale this still works out cheaper so i'm pretty excited i ended up picking up two bags um the one is pomegranate and the other one is rose um i think i'm gonna go with the rose because you know rose water is very soothing i'm gonna apply that after i do the exfoliating and then i'm gonna go on with my now normal evening skincare like you know the normal serums moisturizer everything but i think today i'm gonna go in with my night treatment which is the transemic acid night treatment so this helps reduce hyperpigmentation i'm gonna come close you guys will see i have a lot of hyperpigmentation up here i don't know why but it, that's like my spot for hyperpigmentation Bubbly, and then go outside because it's also quite cold outside. Let me just grab these tickets. <laughs> yes, that is Manhattan, and I think that's the Hudson River, and that will probably be Jersey on the other side. How incredible is this view! that are the designated seating area for people who are eating because you know social distancing and then we're probably gonna go down there's a very long queue to take pictures because everyone obviously wants to take a picture on the edge um, but the view from here is amazing yeah I'll show you guys in a little bit but um, yeah So you guys, as you can see, this is our view. How beyond amazing is that? Oh, it's so stunning. Life can be torn up, but why couldn't I simply see that I was sick? Yom's moment to shine. So we are done visiting the edge guys and we are headed down. What yo? What is that? You know, okay, I was checking that people down there. Because we're just doing the most. Guys, we finally found 
found Muji and I'm excited because I haven't been here in a while. Yeah. I haven't been here in a while. But it's so funny because we almost never buy anything when we come here. But I made it by some of a few things from here. We want to get a small basket or is Wait, that presumptive? You buy something? Who knows? I am obsessed. I'm obsessed with Muji's like kitchenware. Like this collection here of plates has been my my love. lunch or dinner or a combination of both honestly <laughs> but I wanted to show you guys my order from the Daily Grace company <laughs> I've been waiting for this order for almost a month I ordered at the end of November um, after like Cyber Monday the week after Cyber no the, the week of Cyber Monday um, and it's, it only got delivered today because post office, right? So, I don't know where to start first. The most interesting thing, yeah, I think I'll work my way up to the best part. So, I got these um, blush Bible tabs. So, it's like sticker notes that you can put on the various books of. I'll put an, an image in um, as you're doing Bible study. And then I got this Bible handbook. Which looks like this. And basically, it's just like a, a handbook that helps you basically work your way through all the books of, of the Bible. And it gives you like a, a historical narrative. Um, for each book so it kind of sets the scene which I find always helps with my Bible study because it gives you context it talks about the people who are in a specific um, book um, so yeah it basically just sort of gives context for each and every part of the Bible um, yeah so like now this one has divided the Bible into what they call the genres of scripture so they have the ones which are like a historical narrative the epistles the prophets the first five books and, and so forth so it definitely is a good way to go through the Bible and just really get a whole understanding and just learn a bit more you know and then finally guys I'm so excited for this this is the Illuminated Bible and it's the Art Journaling Edition. I got the English Standard Version because I find that that's easier for me to read. Um, basically guys, oh, this is such a beautiful Bible. And then it's got the gold on the side. And this box is so beautiful too, I won't even throw it away. It says here, the unfolding of your words gives light. Oh love it so it looks like this and what I love about this specific Bible is that um, it allows you to like one make notes so it's got obviously the, the space on the side for you to to make your notes here as well for you to journal if you want to but most importantly for me specifically right it's got this because I'm the type of person I love to make notes and draw and make things pretty when I study something so I'm pretty hyped 
to just highlight and color and just have fun with it and have fun with the word when I'm studying the word like I'll show you like this is one of the cover pages for Deuteronomy uh, let's find another image that's fun and it's got like this see you can like literally like draw and just get creative and for me that's just a fun way to study the word but for now I'm gonna continue watching TV and I'll see you guys maybe tomorrow actually no I should actually be closing this vlog off I recognize that it is not too much content but though I think it's long enough I mean it was just Friday and Saturday but I feel like it's, it's a good amount of content that's not too boring um, but yeah I think I'm gonna cut this off here because I need to edit this tonight so that I can have it up tomorrow because we're back we're back like we never left I was hoping to show you Yom's Ghana haul but we just aren't able to do it today so yeah please you guys make sure you're subscribed I really want to get to 3,000 followers soon and call me crazy but I do want to get to 5k followers this year I feel like it's possible guys so tell your friends and their friends to subscribe but let's get to 5k guys 5k that's my goal um, and oh guys did you guys see that I did a paid post please engage with that post on Instagram I'll see you guys um, next week